Welcome everyone. The first new feature with Stage Manager is if I swipe out here, you can change your windows into more sizes than you could compared to the iPadOS 16, as you can see right here. iPhone only apps, you can't stretch out, so keep that one in mind. They've also added this feature where you can move the windows for the Stage Manager in virtually anywhere on the screen. In the past, it would either lock to the right hand side or lock to the left hand side. I'm gonna add multiple apps so I can show you the next feature. When you swipe out to the multitasking view, they have disabled the ability to interact with your currently open windows. So if I drag and drop here and I get out of this view, we can now interact with our apps, no problem. Moving to the Stage Manager external display, I don't have it active, but here are the features. First thing, if you connect an external camera to your iPad, you will be able to use that external camera for FaceTime calls. And in the future, you should be able to use the external camera for any camera app. On top of this, when you go to the lock screen, the lock screen wallpaper will show on the external monitor as a screensaver, but you will need to interact with the iPad itself to unlock the device. Also, the control center here. Many people want to play audio from their iPad when connected to the external display. Apple has not added this feature with iPadOS 17 for some reason. You can output to any wireless device, your headphones, but not the iPad itself. That feature is still missing. And the device support for Stage Manager and Stage Manager external display has remained the same. So iPad Air 4, iPad 10th generation, they both miss out for no reason. Here is everything new. And if you enjoyed, please leave a like. I told you the features and no fluff. Bye bye.